Good viewers, welcome to my uh, session, my today's session on SBT on English and day on session 3 and on. So, welcome to my sessions. This name of the session, the name of the session relating EFT contents with the competency. Dear Honorable Teachers, we know that Bangladesh has a consistent coherent primary curriculum textbook are developed in accordance with the with these competencies teachers of primary school have to a clear understanding or clear conception about the curriculum so our dp is going to arrange a curriculum training curriculum based training new curriculum based training recently and we have also some terminal competencies related to English subject also have attainable competencies and learning outcomes against the TC and HC. So in this session we will discuss about our terminal competency, attainable competency and learning outcomes and relation what is the relation between EFT and learning outcomes. So this session is very important for every participants because we have need to know about our curriculum objects of the session by the end of the session our participant will be able to state the objects of teaching english in the primary schools of bangladesh describing competencies of english subject for grade one to five relate attainable competency and learning outcomes with respective content and activity two in our activity one that um, there was a uh, warm-up activities so i we don't discuss it here you will all you will uh, take a warm-up activities for energizing for the participants activity two is staying stating the terminal competencies of english subject we know we have 31 terminal competencies in English and we also know that in our English subject we have four basic skills that is listening, speaking, reading and writing and we have also some terminal competencies on listening that is to recognize basics English sound differences, stage and intonation to understand some comments, instructions and request and carry them out, to understand simple questions and statements, to listen to understand and enjoy simple rhymes, poems and stories. These force are based on listening and we have also some uh, terminal competencies on speaking, that is we have eight terminal competencies for speaking and it is also for very important uh, also very important because based on listening and speaking uh, a person learn or a student learns any kind of language so for speaking to use english sound stress and intonation appropriately to exchange greetings and farewells and to make introductions to ask and answer questions to recite rhymes and poems to say the names of the day of the week and the month and to tell and to tell the time to talk about simple things and actions to give instructions commands and to make requests to take part in conversation on topics related to students daily life these are the terminal competencies for speaking then we have also some competency based on uh, reading to read the text aloud, aloud text with proper pronunciation, stage and intonation, to recognize and read both cardinal and ordinal numbers, to read the names of the days of the week, the month and the time, to read aloud poems with proper stage and intonation, to read silently with understanding paragraphs, stories and other text materials, to read instructions and carry out them, to re uh, recognize punctuation marks and read accordingly these are the terminal competencies 
for reading skill and we have also some terminal competencies uh, for writing to write non cursive and cursive letter both capital and small to write cardinal and ordinal numbers to write words phrases and sentences using non cursive and cursive letters both capital and small to write figures for words and words for figures to use uh, punctuation marks to use capital letters uh, to write the name of the days of the week and the month and to write the time to write words phrases and sentences correctly to take detections to take to write short and simple compositions to write simple personal letter personal letter to fill in simple forms these tools are based on writing so we have 30 on terminal competencies in, uh, in english okay let's search uh, now uh, we want to discuss about the terminal competencies uh, distribution class wise attainable competency we know that uh, terminal com competency uh, has uh, written based on class wise terminal competency listening to recognize basic english sound difference stretch and intonation class 1 2 3 4 and 5 and we know some of our competencies start uh, from class 1 and end in class 5 but some of our competencies uh, may not start from class 1 it may also start class 2 3 okay such as uh, speaking terminal competencies number 6 uh, in class 1 there is no point class 2 there is no point it starts it starts from uh, class 3 six point on and class 4 and class 3 so as a teacher we have to know we have a clear idea we have a clear conception we have a clear understanding about the curriculum and we have also discussed, uh, we want to discuss, we no need to, I think no need to discuss about reading and writing. Uh, you will discuss uh, everything to the participant. Now I am going to discuss about activity three, relating competencies and learning outcomes with respective content. For this region, this is a group work. For this region, we have to uh, divide the participant into five group, group A, group B, group C and group D and group A uh, we have to supply them uh, textbook and curriculum group A class 1 new book and new curriculum and that's a class 2 3 4 textbook and carry old curriculum uh, um, we have to provide them and they will get 25 minutes to do the group work mainly they have to find out uh, they have to find out how many terminal competencies for listening speaking reading and writing to be practiced by the lear uh, learners in class 1 2 3 4 5 uh, these are worksheet for and based on this worksheet they will do the group work okay they will do the group work after completing the group work, they will present their group work in a plenary session and if they need to any suggestion or need to any support or feedback, the tenor will give them uh, that feedback. After uh, completing the, uh, the activities, the tenor will send a message to the participant that here is a new message for you what is the message this message is very important and everybody should to know the message the message is some terminal skills are not started from grade on especially reading and writing learning outcomes of each content is predetermined uh, i think uh, it is clear to you predetermined means Purbo Nidharito, learning outcomes such a Purbo Nidharito, a Kishikisu learning outcomes, which is called reading and writing at Ketri, Shetikintu from grade on, or the class on Tikishuru Hainai. Teachers have to keep records of 
records to their students achieved the learning outcomes or not. If not, support them to achieve the taught learning outcomes. This, this is very important. Okay. And a teacher need to give them uh, support to ensure everybody's mastery learning, every student's mastery learning. Teachers will have to assess their learners learning by using similar difficult levels items taken from the outside of the textbook. Dear honorable viewers, teachers and mentors, I would like to mention here that this is the old curriculum. This is based on our old curriculum, but now we have a little a new curriculum. Uh, you can also discuss about the new curriculum. It will find you from our EFT class on. Here is our new curriculum designed. Okay. And after grouping the after completing the plenary session, you have to send this message and by this uh, you will close the session and then you will assess your participants by this type of questions. How many terminal competencies are there for his skills in English subject? Which skill are focused mainly in class 1 and 2? We know that in grade 1 and 2, we have uh, only two skills mainly that are focused on mainly two skills, listening and speaking. How many content or unit or lessons are there in class 1, 2 and so on? In this session, you can discuss our new book, new, uh, new book of English and we already get it in our class on new book. We have five units and unit on there is six lessons, unit two there is 20 on lesson, unit three three lessons, unit four six lessons and unit five three lessons. These uh, at, you need to discuss about our new English book class on and three to five uh, as previous book. Okay, because we haven't got any new book. How will teacher assess his or her learners if they achieve the competency or not? Uh, you have to and you have to supply the uh, answer of this question if your participant doesn't answer but already we have supplied the answer of this question okay activity 5 assignment ask them to do the assignment at home that is homework uh, homework because we have to uh, discuss it as a homework select the lesson from each class and find out the learning outcomes and terminal competencies of selected topics do you think that learners will be able to use the learned skill and language item in their real life situation? Situation, Just your opinion with reasons and your practical teaching experience. Tell them they could write the assignment either in Bangla or English. Dear teachers, no more today. Thanks for watching the tutorial. I think this tutorial will be very helpful for every primary teachers. Thanks a lot.